I see this is a personal opinion, so this is not investment advice or anything like this. It's, it's to help you understand the <coughs> question, which I think is fair. I think it's a it's a really quick step up to you know twenty five dollars a share, and all that requires is the is the first step, which is what you're seeing right now. Welcome back to Dummy Boy Finance. I'm Dummy Boy, and I want to go over STNG stock because I finally feel like the ship is starting to sail for this one. And so what we just heard was a snippet of Robert Bugby, the president and CEO of Scorpio Tankers doing an interview. Um, shout out to Marias for doing these updates constantly with uh, these tankers. And so you can clearly hear him say that it's an easy road to $25 a share. And we're trading at $16.47 right now. So that's almost $9 of upside just from this point. And the way he describes it as an easy road because $25 is a relatively fair value for this company. And right now we're looking at STNG on the 30 minute time frame. And I just want to go over the story of this stock in terms of price action since the bottom here in about November, October. So we had kind of a double bottom right here in the $8 range. And then ever since then, we have started to make our way up. And so the biggest thing with this stock that was holding it back for so long was this $14 line of resistance and then as well as this Fibonacci level of resistance and you can see right now we are well above both of these things and so on a technical basis the stock couldn't look more bullish the CEO himself is saying it's an easy ride to 25 we have earnings coming up and in these earnings I'm not expecting anything crazy because I do know that the rates were low um, I do believe though relative to what analysts might expect I think we might actually have a better um, expected earnings than most people might think and so what we might be seeing right now is that pre anticipatory run to the earnings and then we might see a dump on earnings we also are seeing our RSI go up a little bit so I would not be surprised if this one dumps after earnings those people who don't really understand the fundamentals of STNG are going to dump this at the top but those of you who actually believe and understand what's going on with the stock will treat that as another buying opportunity and so the second thing I want to mention on the 30 minute time frame is if we add in our moving averages we are now starting to move over our 200 day SMA again we are above all our moving averages our 50 day SMA is starting to peak out but on the RSI we are overbought and so that is one thing of concern just on a technical basis we do need to see a pullback because this one has been going nuts and the problem with this one is because it's so volatile and it's been down for so long this thing could just keep going and technicals might be thrown out the window with this but in the grand scheme of it we've seen a lot more buying than selling people are starting to pick up on it the company itself is doing insider trading buying up the shares as much as they can and so on a company to company basis i think stng is very well prepared for this next transition into this eco era that we're moving into right now in the world and on a technical basis we are starting to see stng finally start to make some moves this is more of a video for the people who are actually shareholders of this company and quite bullish news in this market right now and just quite bullish overall for a stock that's been suffering for so long and shareholders along with it so quick little update video on scorpio tankers stng stock so if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like we are on the road to 10k subs so if you made it to this point feel free to hit that subscription button this is dummy boy finance i'm dummy boy and i'll see you guys in the next one